Hey, Mark Nelson. Today, this is day five of my five day challenge. Where I want to talk to you about how to overcome fears and accomplish your goals. And it has a lot to do with this five day challenge. Hey, hang on till the end because I have something great to offer you. How you can possibly overcome your fears and accomplish your gear goals and something that will definitely help you out. Let me ask you first though, have you ever set a goal and then just kind of blew it off because you had to over accomplish some fears? Has that ever happened to you? It's happened to me and I'm going to explain what I did to overcome that fear. Hey, if you're coming on here live, drop a one below, tell me where you're coming from. If this is a, you're on a replay, hit hashtag replay and tell me where you're coming from. So let me talk to you again about this. Again, how to overcome your fears and accomplish your goals. You know, I've always had a fear, originally when I got started in this online marketing, about doing Facebook Lives. I was actually in a mastermind once, and the mastermind at that time, lives weren't around. It kind of ages me, right? But what we had to do was, there's been great success in online marketing using videos. So the challenge in the mastermind was doing 30 days of videos and uploading to Facebook. Now, that's a little easier than going live because when you hit that button and going live, you're talking, right? At the same time, it was still, I kept trying to get this one minute video so perfect and I thought, oh man, somebody's gonna see this thing on my face. Oh, it's over here. And they're gonna wonder what the heck's going on and all this crap, it's like, man. That's a bunch of hogwash. Have you ever had something hold you back? Some kind of fear that really wasn't there, but you put it so much up in this head it really boggled you down? If you have, just type yes below, Y-E-S, type me a yes below. Hey, I wanna show you something. If, if you have been following me, I'm gonna try to get over here so you can see my stairs. This is, if you see below here, this is where I live. And you can kind of see the stairway. Whoops, I forgot to point on the screen right there. My wife and I, one of our goals was to live in an RV on the lake, right? Um, so this is what we did. We bought an RV a year ago, and it's actually a pull behind trailer. We parked at the lake. Well, we've had, we got six inches of rain in one day, and it is, uh, we can't live there right now. So we're holed up in a motel, and I think you've seen some of my lives there. and. Um, the coolest part is, man, I can say this, I can tell you that this sucks, and it does, but you know what? I live at the lake. It's just an inconvenience being where I'm at. So how do you overcome your fears and accomplish your goals? And I think fears have a big part of this thing. So many people want to build a huge business. I want to build a huge business. But there's this fear that people have that I have that's like, well, Who's gonna believe me? I have friends that are gonna make fun of me. What the heck? I mean, who who the heck has ever gonna believe what I'm doing? It's that fear of the unknown or fear of what people are gonna think of you. Well, you know what? Blue on that. Cause they don't pay my bills. My friends and family don't pay my bills. My friends and family didn't buy my RV. I bought my RV and do you know how I did that? because I overcame some fears about how foolish I was about what I thought people would think me being on video, me doing a live. So I set a goal and I first did it in something just like this five day Facebook live challenge, five days. I did a challenge and got a little bit more comfortable. Now I did this challenge because I'm involved in such an unstinking believable community of people that are just pushing me up, are just really cheering me on. But there's also prizes. And the top three prizes are unbelievable because I get to work hand in hand when, if by great chance, I'm gonna say when I win this contest, or first, second, and third, I get to work with one of the top markers in, on internet marketing. And how cool is that? 
I keep seeing people coming down here, so I'm kind of seeing uh, who's coming to bug me on my Facebook Live. So, would you like to be in a Facebook Live? Would you like to challenge yourself to see how much you can accomplish? If you do, I got something really cool for you. See, we're gonna start up this Facebook Live again. And by before you get going, what we do with this Facebook Live challenge is there is a, a booklet that guides you on how to set up your lives and how the topics to talk about and what you need to be doing. If you would like that, type download in the comments below. D-O-W-N-L-O-A-D. See, I've told people before I'm a math teacher, so my spelling's kind of bad, but I do know how to spell download. But give me a download in the comments below. And what I'll do is I'll shoot you that PDF. Unbelievable how much this helped me. But what we'll also do, we will get notice that you want to be in the next live and you can come and compete. Not compete, but maybe just come in and overcomplish, overcome your fears and accomplish a goal of competing or doing a five-day challenge. Five-day challenge! It feels so good when you're done. And you're going to meet some cool people inside this community that are not going to laugh at what you're doing, unless you're funny. What they're going to do is support you and cheer you on and give you high fives and tell you how you can accomplish more than you've ever thought you'd accomplish before. So type me a download before. D-O-W-N-L-O-A-D. And I'll shoot you that link. Y'all take care. Again, I got one of these technical schmoove things, right? But that lake is so stinking pretty. It's 880 miles of water or of shoreline. It is 10 feet high. It's actually dropped a foot. So I'm over here looking. I can see my stairs today. It's a mess. But we have one more week till we can move back here.